This film is a unique film because it was shot by students just like you. The reason why we created Teen Truth was to give students like you a voice, to motivate you to think and empower you to make a difference in the world. Filmmakers Aaron Christopher and J.C. Pohl gave five high school students cameras and asked them to record their senior year. What the filmmakers got was a raw and perhaps rare glimpse of what teenagers really think and feel. They've started traveling to school showing that film to high school students. I believe that this presentation will be unlike anything you've ever seen before. Teen Truth debuted last September and is touring classrooms and conferences across the nation to reach out to students, teachers, and parents. What you do and say and how you look at each other every single day has an impact on the person sitting next to you, behind you, beside you. And you have the power to make this the safest, healthiest, happiest place it can be. The gangs, the alcohol, the drugs are just symptoms of what we're really needing in life. And that's that connection with each other. In the end, those who made this film hope simply to prompt people to talk. Based on the response, it appears they have a lot of school assemblies in their future. Everybody in this room right now, we create a community, whether you like it or not. And when you go out of those doors, the community is going to get bigger and bigger. We really start to think about the power that you have, not only on this school as leaders, but going off into the world. What are you going to do as an adult? What are you going to do to make this world the best place it can be? I believe that you have that power. I want to share with you when my life started changing. This one experience switched my path to where I am today. We forget the good things, but the bad things, we remember. They last a lifetime. Please stand if you've ever been punched, kicked, tripped, or shoved on purpose by someone else. I want you to raise your right hand if this has ever happened to you. Have you ever had a rumor spread about you on MySpace, text message, Facebook, I don't care where? I want to ask you to sit down if you've ever done any of those things. If you've ever punched, kicked, tripped, called someone a name, spread a rumor, made a racist comment, excluded somebody. Look at that. Every single one of us has been the bully too. Sometimes something can just happen at home and it gets you all mad and you come to school and you just like let it out on someone. It all started off with that first hit. These days, we place great importance on filling the brain with knowledge, but no one seems to care about filling the heart with compassion. Have you been learning compassion? Have you been learning how to love each other? Because I think you should be. I think you should be going out of your way to learn compassion from each other. This represents love. This represents life, living. These scissors represent drugs and alcohol. It's up to you to teach and learn it from each other every single day. And when you do that, you make a difference in each other's lives. And that, I think, is the most important thing. You see someone being bullied? Step in, step up, help them out. That's all it takes. And you guys have the power to do it. Question is, Will you take control of the situation? Will you define that moment, or will you let that moment define you? If you start making a difference in each other's lives, things will change. If you're not making a difference, what are you doing? If you're not making a difference, what are you really doing? If you're not making a difference, what are you doing? If you're not making a difference, what are you doing? Well, let's go out and make a difference. Thank you all so much.